Muay Thai and boxing are two highly popular combat sports that are known for their striking techniques. While both sports involve punches, there are some key differences between Muay Thai and boxing that make them unique in their own ways. Let's explore these differences and see how they stack up against each other in the fight for striking dominance. 1. Striking Techniques Boxing In boxing, fighters primarily use punches with their fists, including jabs, hooks, uppercuts, and crosses. The emphasis is on head and body movement, footwork, and precise punching techniques. Muay Thai Muay Thai incorporates punches like boxing, but it also allows the use of elbows, knees, and kicks. Fighters can strike with their fists, shins, knees, and elbows, making it a more versatile striking art. 2. Clinching and close-range techniques Boxing. Clinching or grappling at close range is not allowed in boxing. Fighters are separated by the referee if they engage in clinching, and it's not a part of the sport's strategy. Muay Thai Clinching is a fundamental aspect of Muay Thai. Fighters can engage in clinching to control their opponent's movements, deliver knee strikes, and set up sweeps or throws. This aspect adds a different dimension to the striking game and requires a unique skill set. 3. Defensive Techniques Boxing Boxing places a strong emphasis on defensive techniques, such as head movement, footwork, and blocking punches with gloves and arms. Boxers must develop excellent reflexes and positional awareness to avoid getting hit. Muay Thai Muay Thai fighters also employ defensive techniques like blocking and evading punches, but they must also defend against kicks, knees, and elbows. This requires a broader range of defensive skills and awareness of different strike angles. 4. Conditioning and Fitness Boxing Boxing training focuses on developing explosive power, speed, and endurance. Fighters require high levels of cardiovascular fitness, agility, and quick reflexes. Muay Thai Muay Thai training also emphasizes cardiovascular conditioning, but it places additional emphasis on developing power in kicks, knees, and elbows. Fighters need to condition their shins and forearms to withstand strikes and develop clinching strength. 5. Competition Rules Boxing In professional boxing, fighters compete in a boxing ring wearing gloves and adhere to specific rules, such as not striking below the belt, not hitting the back of the head, and not clinching. Muay Thai Muay Thai fights take place in a ring as well, but fighters can strike with multiple limbs and engage in clinching. Rules vary depending on the promotion, but strikes to the head, body, and legs are typically allowed. In terms of striking dominance, it's challenging to determine a clear winner between Muay Thai and boxing. Both sports have their strengths and unique techniques. If a boxer and a Muay Thai fighter were to face each other with their respective rule sets, the outcome would heavily depend on the individual fighter's skills, strategies, and adaptability. Ultimately, the choice between Muay Thai and boxing comes down to personal preference, goals, and the desire to compete in a specific sport. Some individuals may prefer the versatility and clinching aspects of Muay Thai, while others may enjoy the pure science of boxing. Both sports offer tremendous physical and mental benefits and have their places in combat sports.